Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Next, we're going to talk about the line style button, the dash style button, and the arrow style button, which you can see in the lower right corner on the drawing toolbar. These three buttons act together to duplicate some of the features of the Colors and Lines tab of the Format dialog box. If you click any one of these buttons, a pop-up menu appears that allows you to change either the width of the currently selected line, the dash style of the currently selected line, or the arrowhead and tail of the line that's currently selected. So for example, if we wanted to take the selected line in our document and cr increase its width or pick a different style, we could select that from the list of line styles available. If we wanted to segment it in some way, we could use the dash style. Note that at the top of the dash style is the solid line. If you wanted to convert the line into an arrow, you could pick one of the arrow styles available. Note also that at the very top of the arrow styles is arrow style 1, which is simply a solid line. So you could convert an arrow back into a straight line if you prefer using that button as well. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.